Hello everyone, welcome to my channel today. I'm doing my blessings, coming to sign for Taurus, and keep in mind that this will not resonate for all of you. If you like a personal reading, I'll leave that description down below. Another thing you do is we have memberships on the channel, so you go ahead and join, become a member, get access to all those perks. Okay, Taurus, so, we're on the deck for the overall energy. We have the King of Swords. King of Swords, that's air energy, so you could have some air in your chart. Maybe you have an air sign coming towards you. Let's see. We got Judgment. The Emperor. Aries Energy. The High Priestess. Pisces Energy. Nine of Wands. King of Pentacles is Earth Energy, your own energy, Taurus. And then we have the Strength card, Leo Energy. Taurus, the good thing that's coming to you is, number one, that you reconnecting or connecting more to your intuition, like your spiritual side, High Priestess, all these cards here. I see you being more money-focused or more business-focused. Emperor, King of Pentacles. Taurus, I feel like you're going to be led by your intuition throughout the rest of May. Uh, where you're supposed to be, what things you're supposed to do, like you're going to know where you're going to need to be, right? So, on the bottom of the deck, for the overall energy for this deck, we have the Knight of Wands. Knight of Wands has passion, determination, fire energy, like a lot of... We have the Knight of Swords, Page of Swords, Nine of Cups. I see someone wanting to speak to you. I also see you getting a wish coming true. Five of Cups, Ten of Swords, Ten of Pentacles. Taurus, I see whatever you wish, whatever you've been wishing for, it's coming in. You also have someone wanting to speak to you. Ten of Pentacles. You know what that is? That stability in money, increasage in money, stability in the home life, family life, you know, relationships, all that. It's good things towards. Maybe some of you have been wishing for that. Ten of Swords, Five of Cups. But I see you being sad about something that ended in your life previously. Looking back on something that ended. Taurus, you do have good things coming towards you. A lot of good things. Like you got this big abundance coming your way that you've been wishing for. Extra cards for you, we have friendship. Number 47, connect to source. Go within to discover what needs to be done. Create the shift required to attract what you want. Okay, Taurus, so that's a message for you. Number two, with transparency. Honest, authentic, genuine, present. Number one, the ancient grandmother teacher. I'm the teacher that leads with self-knowledge. So that's you, Taurus. Peace. So you got peace coming in your life. Number 18, with anxiety. But I see you kind of like being in this worried, anxiety sort of energy, Taurus. Friendship. And transparency. I have a friend reach out to you that's like very honest, or you have someone like that coming into your life. So, Taurus, that is all I have for you. Let me know if that resonates. Thank you for watching. If you want to see more content, don't forget to like, subscribe. Bye, guys.